Well, the Colorado Buffaloes take the field on September 1st on a Friday night down in Denver for the Rocky Mountain Showdown. This will be one of the seniors that will be leading the defense on the field. Voice of the bus, Mark Johnson, senior defensive end. Tim Coleman joining us here for a couple minutes. Yes, sir. You're a senior now, all this responsibility. How do you approach this? You know, you approach it with a level of focus, you know. Um, more or less getting yourself right. You really got to focus on your teammates and making sure everyone's on the same page, loving guys doing their job and making sure everything goes smoothly. This defensive front, you know, we talked about earlier with Jim Jeffcoat, the defensive line coach. We talked about, you know, there were three 300-pounders up there a year ago, all yes, seniors. Those guys move on, NFL, graduation. So there's a little bit of responsibility for everybody stepping in this year, isn't it? Yes, sir, there is. Yeah. And how do you uh, how do you kind of handle that? How do you make sure that this group of young linemen, being one of the older guys then, the guys are kind of towing the line, doing what they're supposed to do? You know, you just, uh, in practice, you got to work hard. Mm -hmm. You know, you got to push the guy next to you because you're only going to be as good as the weakest person, so we focus on that a lot. Focus on getting uh, mental reps all the time during walkthroughs, and if we're not in, we're trying to coach up the other guy to make sure he's doing things right. Just kind of like building a family. How are you better now here in your senior year? How am I better? Yeah, I'm better probably focus-wise. Um, I'm better understanding that my teammates are what we need to be great. You know, without my teammates, without you can't be a great pass rush unless you have three other guys on the line with you that are grinding just as hard as you. Are you confident? You know, Jimmy Gilbert got what nine or ten sacks a year ago. Are you confident with like yourself and maybe a guy like uh, Derek McCartney that you guys can generate pressure this season? Oh yes, sir. Um, Derek McCartney, uh, Lyle, Frank, uh, Leo. Uh, Jace, Frankie, they all have great practice ability, and so that's what I was saying. Like every single one of them is great, has the potential to be amazing. So that helps me out a lot because I know that if I'm not going to get the sack, someone yeah. else is. <laughs> More competition, right? <laughs> yeah, oh, without question. You know, you look at this defense in Yurga. There were some pretty big personalities in the back end of this thing, right? Cheeto and, and guys like that, Tedrick, uh, Akello. Uh, does this defense have a personality yet? I mean, who, who's kind of emerging as kind of one of the vocal leaders of this group? You think? Uh, definitely Rick Gamboa yeah. and uh, Fo. Afalabi Laguda, they definitely have a, a big voice in the defense right now. Um, Isaiah Oliver, Nick Fisher, those are the guys in the back end. Um, they have a lot of personalities, though. Sure. A lot of characters. No, right? Without question. Sure. <laughs> you know, last year, when a team goes and wins 10 games like you guys did a year ago, you win the Pac-12 South, go to the title game, go to a bowl game, that kind of raises the bar, doesn't it? Yes, sir. And you come into 2017, now it's time to push that thing up even farther, isn't it? Yes, sir. Yeah. There's a lot of... Uh, a lot of angst about trying to be great, a lot of uh, hard work that needs to be put in. You know, we're trying to do better than we did last year. All right, we'll go sure. and do it. All right, sir. Sure. That's uh, Tim Coleman, defensive end for the Colorado Buffaloes. They open the season September 1st against Colorado State in the Rocky Mountain Showdown.